phones like the iPhone has optical image stabilization. So that means that inside the camera module, the camera moves to compensate for the movement of the phone. So let us see how it works. So to explain about optical image stabilization, I have my friend Riddle Chick here. So we have seen two axis stabilization, three axis and even four axis stabilization in phones like the Xiaomi Mi 5. So let us see how it works. So if we consider the head of the chicken as a camera module and the neck portion as the optical image stabilization mechanism. So let us see how it works. So as you can see that uh, one of my friend is holding this and as you can see he is moving it sideways but the head is remaining constant. So this is what happens on phones also. Motion. Now let us see upward and downward motions. As you can see the body is moving but the camera remains stable. So this gives us some blur videos and the mechanism of optical image stabilization is also somewhat like this. So now let me show you some circular movements. As you can see the body is moving too much on circular methods but the head is remaining stable and constant. So let us consider that this is the body of the phone and this is the camera module. So you shake this body but the camera module remains constant. So this is the method companies use to give some blur free videos. So thanks to Mr. Chicken, my best friend for being a good subject and uh, for letting me explain about optical image stabilization to you. And by the way, don't try this at home. It is one of the chicken from my poultry farm and we take good care of it. So no animals were harmed in any way. If you like this video, like, share and subscribe. Till then it's Jones and I'm signing off.